we back in the kitchen again guys as you can see today we give you how to marinate your pork and put it on for 24 hours guys it's one of the best thing you can ever do you know sometimes you can marinate your pork the same day and cook it the same day but the sweetest part of the pork is when you marinate it and put it on for the next day guys hopefully you will enjoy the recipe leave your comments and we're going to show you how to cook the pork so that's the volume one of the pork how to marinate it i'm going to do the volume two how to cook it enjoy the recipe leave your comments thank you so much for watching the cooking program remember the cooking book is out get your copy and share it with your neighbor with your friend and with your co-worker have a great day enjoy yourself from chef Bye bye and lovely welcome back in the kitchen one more time one more time for the menu guys we're gonna do some pork i get a request for the pork and i definitely want to do we're gonna do some pan fried pork but before we do our pan fried pork guys this is what we're gonna do first let's get cracking on with the meat this is some pork chops right here basically make sure you got on your gloves that's the key so i'm gonna put on my gloves now and I got one, two, three, four, five, six pieces of pork chops. And I'm gonna put it straight inside of this bowl right here. Make you guys can see what's going on. This is my bowl, which I wanna marinate my pork chops in. I'm gonna put them straight inside of it, just like this. You can see I just wash off my pork chops then with some lemon juice. This is my lemon juice right here. I just wash it off. So as I said, I wash it off with my lemon juice. I use a half of a lemon, squeeze at it, and also I put some white vinegar. Basically, I'm gonna show you some more ingredients which I do have right here. Just to make you guys see what I'm talking about. Right here, I have a piece of a ginger cut up scotch bonnet pepper, fresh thyme, fresh spring onion, garlic, garlic, and white onion. We're gonna pour everything straight down inside of the bowl like this. Make sure you get it straight inside of the bowl. When you finish with the area, please sanitize the area very, very good for me, guys. Right here, I have some pimento seed. I'm gonna pour it straight inside of it. And next thing, we're gonna put some seasoning. One teaspoon, tablespoon of pork seasoning. teaspoon of all-purpose seasoning and right over here we've got some coriander and garlic we're gonna put a teaspoon not a tablespoon teaspoon this time then next thing we got some paprika we're gonna put a teaspoon of paprika getting the flavor beautiful and then next thing we're gonna do we got some hot and spicy season we're gonna just put a pinch of hot and spicy season lovely basically we're gonna put some olive oil come on olive oil come in come on down beautiful i know you guys said i love this one it's really nice so what you're gonna do you're gonna marinate your pork chaps and put it down for 24 hours so we can soak properly really nice as you can see exactly what i'm talking about right here all of my season everything inside of it this is a scotch bonnet pepper i didn't burst it because i just want the flavor inside of the pork uh, so i'm not gonna put any salt because most of these season i already do got salt so and we have a lot of natural seasoning guys and you can see exactly what is taking place right here so basically we're just gonna get the pork marinade like this and we're gonna pan fry them next as you can see how the pork chops look beautiful and nice pan fry them and we're gonna finish them off in the oven so basically now we are getting the pork chops soak for 24 hours we're not gonna cook them today we're gonna cook them in 24 hours so if you're at home and you want to do the same thing like what I'm doing at the moment, you can do the same thing. Get your pork, marinate, use your daily basic season what you use at home and get your pork marinate. So guys, enjoy the recipe. Please leave your comment, subscribe to the YouTube channel and this is the best way how to marinate your pork for 24 hours and get it soaked. 
and I know you guys are gonna love this one. So enjoy the recipe. Thank you so much for watching the Chef McCoy cooking program. We got a lot more recipe for you. All you need to do is cover it, clean from it, put it in your fridge, in your fridge, and or if you got a meat bag and put it in your fridge. Thank you so much. Bye bye.